Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the morning edition. This is for Friday, the 4th of December. I'm James Spann. Got some rain passing through the state this morning. That'll be moving out pretty quickly. And after that, things look nice and quiet for a while. There's the upper air look this morning. You can see the short wave just north and west of the state helping to produce the rain we have falling this morning. That was the radar a little before 5 o'clock. Rain over much of the state, but that's moving along. And for most everybody, the rain will be gone by late morning. Temperatures are still in the 50s. They've been sitting in the same range now since early yesterday. And will stay in the 50s throughout the day today. The cold spot, though, Haleyville, they've got 43. Around the nation, awfully quiet. We do note red flag warnings from Los Angeles to San Diego for Santa Ana winds. Very dangerous situation there. And up in the northeast, We've got a winter storm watch for parts of New England with a potential nor'easter affecting them. There's the severe weather outlook today, a marginal risk for the beaches of the Florida Panhandle and for eastern North Carolina. And tomorrow, no thunder around the nation. Here's the rain for the next seven days. Basically, what you see down here is what we get today. And amounts will be under one half inch. And after today, we are going to be dry for quite a while. So, model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS, the 06E run at 3 o'clock today. You can see the short wave rolling through here. And down below that, the rain should be gone by 3 o'clock. Cloudy, cool, highs in the mid-50s today. Tomorrow, a beautiful day. We start the day in the mid-30s, the high in the mid to upper 50s. Lots of sunshine. Now, Sunday, evidence moisture might try and work its way back into South Alabama. Clouds will increase across the state. Maybe a few sprinkles for South Alabama. The northern part of the state will likely be dry. And then may, Monday, a clipper system comes through. And again, the GFS is trying to hint there might be a few showers over the northern part of the state, but the European says, nah. And we'll buy that solution. Uh, we'll call it partly sunny Monday, uh, turning cooler, especially over the Tennessee Valley. Any precipitation should be north and east of here. And then Tuesday, the day should be sunny. We'll start the day below freezing, the high in the low 50s. Wednesday, sunny will be close to 60. Thursday, low 60s with a sunny sky. And this is a week from today, Friday the 11th, big trough in the west. Rain to the west, we're still dry. So at this point, all of next week, for most of the state, looking rain-free. Now, this is Sunday the 13th of December off the... Uh, GFS and it's got a very deep surface low that's over Kansas with a blizzard north and west of that and a chance of severe storms south and east of that thing coming through here. And then uh, this is the night of Sunday the 13th in the upper look and you can see a big uh, trough approaching. The surface low is west of Chicago with us getting into a dry slot but this is the European, and it says, nah, don't get too concerned about that situation because it just has a uh, band of rain coming through with no severe weather looks. So, again, the next chance of rain will be that following weekend around the 12th or the 13th, probably the 13th. But do we see any strong storms? Do we see heavy rain, or do we see this? We just don't know that yet. Something to watch for now. And, again, you can see the... Uh, uh, output of the European Ensemble here, the members, the range not quite as great today out there in, at mid-month, but still you got some members at a half inch, some members at almost three and a half inches, the mean one and a half inches. Temperatures pretty blah, I guess, uh, average for this time of the year, mostly 50s, a few days with low 60s, on through mid-month with lows mostly in the 30s and 40s, and the CPC outlook. This is for December 11th through the 17th. And if this verifies, temperatures could be a little, a little above average. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes on the blog. The next video here by 4 o'clock this afternoon. If you can, catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless. There are better ways to keep cool. Call KS Services and receive a new Bryant unit with no payments and no interest for 18 months. Stay cool now and pay later. Visit callks.com for more.